Hey everyone, it's Mexican Toad from Invictus Gaming, back at it again with another video. Now, you guys might be wondering it, what kind of lesson we're going to have, and I'm actually going to tell you. It's going to be a life lesson, but it's not going to be like the first video where the life lesson comes up and we talk about it. So you're going to have to stick with it uh, closer to the end of the video to hear what the life lesson is. Now, I did hide some clues, so keep an eye out and uh, try to figure out what the life lesson is. So, I'll catch you guys later on in this video for that life lesson. So guys, I've actually been thinking about uh, doing a certain type of video where I'm basically going to be doing some uh, gameplay of a game that's a little bit more story driven, uh, more than Call of Duty where it's the main focus is, is multiplayer. Uh, but I just don't know what kind of game to pick up. Now I know I have Final Fantasy set, uh, 15, sorry, uh, but I'm almost done with that game and I don't, I really don't want to do another walkthrough. Uh, so I was wondering if you guys could drop a comment on what game you think I should drop or uh, what game I should actually pick up and do, you know, basically a, a playthrough and take out a couple clips and, and kind of see my reaction. Now I know I was thinking about Resident Evil 7 uh, because I saw a video of this dude and it made me laugh really bad where uh, you know he's, he's playing Resident Evil 7 and he comes up to let's just say some stairs and uh, something happens and he's like nope nope uh, fuck this I'm not doing it and he essentially quits the game uh, mid game like without saving it or anything so it, it made me laugh and I figured you know it, it that kind of game might be good uh, that way y'all can get some reactions out of me maybe hear me scream like a little girl um, but um, it doesn't have to necessarily be a horror game uh, just go ahead and drop a comment like I mentioned on what game you guys think I should go ahead and pick up Okay, so I bet everyone's wondering what the life lesson for today is. Now, if you guys didn't uh, see, there was a knife counter that started, and now we're up to two, so that has something to do with it. Um, now, uh, for today's life lesson, it's actually going to be about persistence, and uh, how we apply this in real life is, no matter how many times you get knocked out, in this case, in the video game, no matter how many times I get knifed, I kept going and now in real life no matter how many times you get knocked down you know you go ahead and pick yourself up you dust yourself off and you take one step forward you don't let this whatever situation you might be going through it don't let it you know keep you down um, here in Evictus gaming you know we're unconquerable and undefeatable now um, and that's just essentially another long motto for persistence um, now I know for me personally and for some friends um, they have amazing support systems with family and friends that they could talk to about anything at any time of the day now you guys now might have that same support system uh, but just try to find that one friend uh, that no matter what you know you can call them up at 2 3 o'clock in the morning talk to them for a couple of hours uh, just to kind of relieve some stress or just to kind of you know uh, share the burden which any good friend will definitely do that without even blinking an eye and I I thankfully uh, have that support system uh, but it doesn't matter if I didn't have it I know I have to be persistent and take whatever life it throws at me and uh, it might knock me down but I stand up and I keep going so to wrap this game up, as you are about to see, I was per a little persistent prick. Uh, no matter how many times I got knifed, I kept going, and uh, I actually ended up winning, as you are about to see. So, guys, that's going to do it for today's video. Uh, if you liked the video, go ahead and drop a like. Uh, go ahead and subscribe to get the newest videos. And uh, go ahead and drop a comment below. Uh, you know, just letting me know if I'm doing a good job or if I suck or uh, whatever you guys want to say. So, I appreciate it, guys, and I will catch you on the next one.